Alright, welcome back, lady and gentlemen. We are in the new journey to spa number two. With the power to unlock the secrets of the universe, Hang on, let's see if he is talking. Everything there was to know about space time and how to enslave it. Res triggered an explosion of technological advancement. Mankind spread to the far reaches of the galaxy, growing exponentially in numbers, along with the reliance on Res. The United Terran Alliance was founded to control the countless population. Eventually, they sought to ration the use of Res. As res supplies thinned, conflict arose. An epidemic of fortune-seeking miners forced their way to the galactic core, where resin was most abundant. Eventually, the primary res source was discovered. All res stemmed from a sinister and timeless energy being, a being awakened by the use of res. They had sprung an ancient and recursive trap, res being the bait no budding civilization could possibly ignore. Cursing Corruption trap. spilled outward into the stars, twisting the biological matrix of all it touched, integrating it into machines. Mankind's own technology, their own dead, had begun to turn against them. For years they struggled to survive against a flood of abominated metal and flesh. Billions were lost to the infection, only further feeding the expanding corruption. In spite of hopeless obliteration, the very fabric of life itself arose to fight the dark entity. As a race, humanity came together for a single purpose. In some twisted way, they had found peace. About time. Peace, however, does not last. People fell back into their self-minded ways. Humanity turned inward in a scramble for the remaining res, which now could no longer be renewed. As the UTA lost its control over the galaxy, they collapsed the entire warp gate network beyond any hope of salvage. Human ingenuity, it turns out, knows no captivity. A resin-based drive was developed, allowing more direct travel anywhere in the galaxy. The Void was reborn as a wild, untapped, and lawless frontier. Oh yes. As years pass, piracy and skirmish battles rage. Precious res the prize. Raw worlds are recklessly colonized and disputed by legions of makeshift starships. An entire ecology of nomadic drifters emerged, endlessly recycling the wrecks of constant war. All the while, the nearly forgotten saviors of the galaxy tirelessly struggle to exterminate the last remnants of the infection. And there we have it. It seems like, yet again, you dimwits have flown my ship headlong into an infested region. That is the third time this week. Six million forms of communication, and I'm yet to find one that can articulate how moronic you fools are. Computer, power Pardon the me? And shield emitters. The doctor is in. How dare you call me? Okay, so... Am I shooting? Oh, I'm shooting. Let's fly faster. I left my shooting. Boosting engine. Where's my health? My secret health. Okay, okay. How many? The radar? No radar. Laser. What a problem, no. A very fast shooting laser. Okay. One on the right hand. Finish. Break. Looks like I'm taking some kind of damage. I mean, a lot. That would be initial plus. Very fast shooting uh, lesbian I got here. Destroy, destroy. And we speed. Oh. 
Good job. Oh crap. My ship destroyed. Okay. Nice. Level 13 is truly the bane of my existence. Calm, seriously? Do you realize crew members suffocated on the lower decks because you routed power from life support to play stupid video games? <laughs> Silence, imbecile. They gave imbecile. their lives for the greater good. A scientific mind must stay active or it would wither and wrinkle. I'll boil any ocean. I'll irradiate a whole litter of Narlakian pups. I'll divide by zero if I have to. I told you he'd cause trouble if you leave him to his own whim. Those implants could really make a man sick of the melon. Elsa, he is a liability if we keep him on board. Please refrain from sneaking up on another living creature like that. Do you not realize the horror people have to endure every time like Dr. Kerr has some uh, you are serious I double stand there. certainly dismember you in a panic-induced frenzy. Everyone, shut up to the bridge right now. Anyone not now. in 30 seconds is getting vented into space. Oh, yeah. I like that attitude. So did well, I... No. I'm glad to see okay, everyone was able new to star. get up at the crack of noon to work towards sustaining our survival. Let me present to you all the garbage dump we'll be sifting through this afternoon. Yes, most of this is useless junk. Yes, this is utterly pathetic, but what choice do we have? That's this right, no what choice do we have? Here, metal mother. The lady deserves better. Let me be snapping on something fresh. Um, he might not be the best candidate to operate the tractor prototype. Keep in mind that Carl built this thing, so it goes without saying that it's dangerous. I'd hate to have come all this way just to have Mackenzie rip us apart like a rabid chimp with Carl's untested toys. You know how those two can be. <laughs> I don't really care who does what, but we need to jump on this opportunity to expand the mothership. That core module will give us some elbow room, or those wings will give us some much needed firepower. Let's get those modules fitted so we don't have to listen to each other breathe anymore. Please pay close attention to the moving picture feature film show. Hmm. You will be subjected to standardized testing following this demonstration. Okay. Uh, Mother ship, Ted Pack, use core, core, Windows engine, tractor pack, left control, remove left control, left control. What? Okay. Left control. Oh crap. Where's it go? Pardon me? Uh okay. Uh, what's it? Hmm. Macro blaster. Win, win, put on win now. Huh? Remove pack. Okay. Put it in. Stop moving. You silly bugger. Hmm. Four. Oh, hello. Macro blaster. Huh? Yeah. What whatever that is? Another macro blaster. What exactly do hmm. you think you're doing? Uh, where is it? Leaning on that overhead projection like a crutch. This isn't some archaic top down <coughs> space shooter we're playing here. Kitten eating life. Brutal kitten eating life we're talking about. Hmm. Join the rest of us down you here. You mean in reality. Okay, like that. Ooh, hello. Nice. Looking. Our omnilithium capacitor is now tapped out. I've devised a method to simply eject the spent cell while fabricating a new one out of surrounding space dust. Do not ask me how it works or why it makes sense. All that you need to know is that you will be unable to fire the ship's weapons while the new cell is being installed. Right. Uh, 
Okay. Now I'm going forward. No. Looking. Going. Let's go. You flying? Reload. <gasps> Turn on. Reload. All right, I'm bringing the weapons online. If that thank you, thank you. Want to call this You're very kind. Blast open some of these containers. Maybe we can find something to eat that won't make our hair fall out. I have decided that it would be best if basic resource towing was left up to the ship's computer. These items are too fragile to be handled by Neanderthals. Neanderthals. It would be great pain <laughs> to watch you struggle with the tractor beam. Whatever you say, man. Engine online. Let's go. Am I flying? Am I? I am. I am flying. Am I? Oh, good. Hello. Ooh, that's a bum into me, isn't it? Oh, that the camera. Can it change? No. I better go this direction then. Control. Oh, there we go. Come to Papa. Aha! Physic 101. No. Oh. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Wait, wait, wait. Scrap. Come here. Oh, bridge. Please assimilate and perform the following diagnostic tests on the kinetic shield system. Your life and my hull may depend upon it. Oh. I did not know that until you pointed it out. Still charging. Why is that funky looking thing here? Oh! <gasps> Where's the... Oh! Hey. Anything in it? Oh, hello! <gasps> Some stuff over there! Oops! Hey! I don't think I mean to do that! Speed up! Boosting seal, okay. Oh, hang on, hang on. I don't think. Oh, hang on. What are they? Wrap. Oxid gas. Okay. Excuse me. <gasps> oh, man. <gasps> mining, mining facility? I don't know what I supposed to do. All modern space capable go. engines come equipped with special regenerating boost capacitors. Please practice making rocket go fast now. Please practice. Hmm. Um. Oops. Uh. Hmm. It mean to be doing that? What's going on? Anything come out? No? Come on, man. Boosting engine. I have to say I'm impressed. Oh, me too. Able to lace this Trust thing me. Back together without eating each other. The only thing that remains is to test the res. From scotch and caviar to beers and tears, how is it that Jameson is the only other one with ambition to dig out of this dung heap? Just cook those bloody engines up and lay in a course for somewhere that isn't here. Please. Roger, roger. What are they? Can I have plan? Okay. So, I thought that they minerals, anyhow. How about that? What is it? Come here. 
Oh crap. Nothing. Welcome to the Super Ultra Star Map 9000. This holographic interface will allow you to scan all interface, all the rapid mothership destinations me. and communicate with other ships and star bases. Please practice I'm using it on the 24 inch monitor here. Game saved. Oh, who's that? It's a cute to cancer. What's <laughs> time for the fancy? I make up. Level 8, oops, level 0. Oh, it's blower. When you move, okay, move. Move. And I'll read this. Now that we are finally underway, let me remind you that you cannot simply urinate in the corner and proclaim you are the alpha meat husk. You hmm. are a minuscule fish in an otherwise colossal ocean of galactic proportions. Unless you wish to be dead before breakfast, Read the breakfast. advisory overlays I have painstakingly programmed you know, for your survival. All Do not just click dinner. past them and complain on the galactic forums that you did not get the memo. Ignorance will not be excused. Read or die. Right. Please familiarize yourself with the star map command functions. Mm, maybe do not assimilate this I do not. Now. I'm not very good it at follow order. For you at dinner time. Where tutorial? Screw you, buddy. Let's go here. Apparently, your intestines are so long that if you strung them up end to end, you'd probably move. Oh, what happened to his tongue? Not everyone can be a winner. If you want to avoid joining the overspending rank of loser, blah blah blah. Hello. Garbage. Okay. What do you mean owned by another captain? Garbage again. What what did it have us? People? What's that? Food? Oh no 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 no. Let's go here. Oh. What's that? Oh, hello. If we tune our warp frequency just right, we can sometimes pick up residual data transmissions bouncing around the old warp network. Though the gates are smashed beyond repair, some seem to be able to hang on to those low density data packets like a ghostly reminder of our past. Hmm. Definitely, I will, uh, I will get that. No signal. Scan and view. Alright. That's fairly easy for Esper Mort. Late during the lockdown wars. Their intended function was to further segregate the inner and outer worlds as an unbreakable gate. Instead of using an encrypted key code, Titan Gates had absolutely no power source, requiring it to be spooled up manually by an energy beam transfer. The beam itself was encoded to ensure that even if one was to amass the astronomical power needed, it would still disallow access. For a time, the Titan Gates were successful, until Carl Memford devised a way to use the Clockworks Deflector Array as an accessor, resulting in the now famous Breach Incident. Hmm. Next place. Okay, that's it, I suppose. And two thousand eight hundred Richard thingy. What does that mean? In an effort to curb interplanetary diseases, just about all our traded goods now have to go through this hands-off filtered interface. Nobody can stab you in the back or shoot you in the face using an interface like this. Just configure the deal, and the autoloaders should take care of the rest. Hmm. Up, up left, up a right bottom. Hmm. 
Some time. All right, so um, I think we we'll wrap it up uh, there, ladies and gentlemen. And uh, next episode, uh, hopefully there will be more action going on instead of I'm sitting <laughs> and reading the text. Until then, enjoy the rest of your day and take care.